The Stanley Parable is full of all sorts of weird and wonderful Easter eggs. The baby crawls left towards danger. You click the button to move him back to the right, and if he reaches the fire, you fail. You heartless bastard. There's also plenty of secret endings. He got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. With the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe releasing in just a couple of weeks, I figured we would check out one of my favourite Stanley Parable Easter egg references. As in Morlock's Redemption 2, an add-on campaign for Left 4 Dead 2, and not long into Chapter 1, you can find a gnome resting on top of a train carriage which can also be picked up. But what happens if you manage to carry him all the way to the beginning of Chapter 3 and then use him? to replace a fuse. Come on, let's do it! Stanley decided to go to the meeting room to find the... Wait a minute. This isn't right. You're not Stanley. I don't recall there being any mention of zombie survivalists. Weapons here! Oh, this isn't right at all. Look, I think if you could go back the way you came, we can all get on with our own games. Go on. There's nothing else to see. Stanley was... Okay, now, are you just doing this to annoy me? Did Stanley put you up to this? Have you killed Stanley? It's because of the egg game, isn't it? Clearly, you're not going to leave until you unleash a few rounds of lead into something. Perhaps a zombie. Well, how's this? Go on, shoot it. It won't bite. Well, it might. Feel better? Hmm, that seemed a little hollow. I suppose we could play the egg game, Although somehow shooting buttons wouldn't seem challenging enough. Okay, let me uh, rethink this. Got it! Just press the big button when you're ready. Extra pistol. I mean the zombie survivalists defeated the horde and then escaped through the door to the left. They felt satisfied. They felt happy. All was well with the world. Stanley? Stanley? 